New file tabs in AutoCAD 2014 provide easy access to your open drawings. Each open file is displayed as a tab across the top of your AutoCAD window, and you can select them to make them active. Uh, if you have more tabs than what will display across the top, there's an overflow menu on the right side that you can open to easily access the additional files. Now you'll notice as I pass the cursor over these files, a preview of the file shows up. You can see model space and the um, layout, and if there are additional layouts, you'll see those as well. The same thing happens when you pass your cursor over the file tabs on top. There are various icons depending on the state of the drawing. For example, if you have a drawing that has changes, maybe you've zoomed or you've made some edits, then you'll see an asterisk there indicating that that file needs to be saved. Uh, if you open a drawing uh, as read only, let me go ahead and do that. I'll just open another file and select one from the construction set here. And this one I will go ahead and make sure it's read only. So if it, a file is open read only, then you'll see an, a lock icon there on the file tab. You can add or create additional drawings right here from this plus icon that's to the right of the file tabs. So if you select that, it opens up the dialog box where you can choose a template to create a new drawing. The drawings are displayed in the order that you open them or create them across the top, but it's very easy to just select a drawing tab and move it to reorder them. You can select on the X icon to close a file, and there are additional icons. When you pass your cursor over and see the preview of the uh, drawing, you can uh, pass your cursor over one of the preview images Notice that as I pass the cursor over, it temporarily displays that preview in the AutoCAD window. And there are icons here for plotting that sheet or uh, publishing it. There are additional tools in the right-click menu. If you right-click over a drawing tab. Now notice that sheet 13 is active for me, but I've right-clicked over drawing 3. Uh, so whichever sheet you right-click or drawing tab that you right-click on, then you'll have access to various tools like create a new, new file or open, save, save as, some of the typical ones. This one is particularly useful. Close all except this tab. So even though my drawing 13 is currently active, I right clicked on drawing 3 right here and I can choose close all except this tab. Now depending of course if I've made any changes I'll be prompted to save those. Uh, but that quickly it closes all the other files except for that one that I right clicked on. So that can be handy when you have a lot of drawings open in AutoCAD. I'm going to go ahead and open up one of those files again and point out some other options on the right click menu. Notice these last two options. If the file that you have open it has been um, saved, then you have these additional options. You can copy the full file path or open the file location. So copy the full file path, then you can paste that location into an email, for example, or open the file location. It takes you right to the Explorer with that file selected in that folder. You can control the display of drawing tabs. If you go to the View ribbon tab and then the User Interface panel, you'll see a new control for file tabs. So right now I've got the file tabs displayed. I can turn that off and again at any time, turn them back on.